day, and thanks for watching the ACS Library. My name is Kyle, and I aim to help in preparing for the private pilot checkride in under five minutes a day. Today's video lesson discusses pilot-performed preventative maintenance. PHAC Chapter 9 describes preventative maintenance as simple or minor preservation operations or the replacement of small standard parts not involving complex assembly. A list of examples, such as changing the oil, changing out a tire, or installing new spark plugs can be found in the FAA Safety Team document, Maintenance Aspects of Owning Your Own Aircraft. These examples may also be found in PHAC Chapter 9. FAR 43-3 Golf explains that any person holding at least a private pilot certificate can perform preventative maintenance, as long as the aircraft does not operate under Part 121, 129, or 135. Private pilots don't operate under these parts. FAR 43-7 states that any person holding a private pilot certificate may also approve aircraft for return to service following preventative maintenance. FAR 43-9 states that all pilots performing preventative maintenance must make an entry in the maintenance record of the aircraft, including a description of the work performed, total time in service, date, a statement explaining that the aircraft has been found to be either airworthy or not airworthy, if found not to be airworthy, an additional explanation must be given as to why, and lastly, the pilot's name, signature, certificate number, and type of certificate held. An example of a pilot-performed maintenance log to be entered into the aircraft's maintenance records is shown here now. This example can be found in FAA Advisory Circular 9167, Minimum Equipment Requirements for General Aviation Operations under Part 91. This concludes today's discussion of pilot-performed preventative maintenance. Thank you very much for watching. I hope it was helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, or share. Safe flying!